regular listener, welcome back. And for everyone here who is new, welcome to Future Forward. At Future Forward, could we use it as a special place where we share stories, sustainability, stories that can help the world or be a better place. Today's episode will focus on SDGs 9, 11, and 12. 9 focuses on industry, innovation, and infrastructure. SDG 11 focuses on sustainability, and SDG 12 focuses on responsible consumption. And that brings us today to our special guest, Nidhi Basin. CEO of NASCOM Foundation. Let's give her a huge applause and welcome her to Future Forward. What were your aspirations when you joined NASCOM Foundation? Firstly, thank you, Adraj, for uh, being here and talking to me. Uh, my aspiration when I joined NASCOM Foundation was that I'm joining an NGO which is working with technology and social impact. So. How can I use this to really change how a country is, especially the people from the marginalized background, and how technology can really go the last mile to empower people, to educate people, and make a huge difference? Question 2. It is important for the industry to have a for the industry to contribute to the SDGs and since we are a part uh, of NASCOM which is an industry body we have an access to many tech companies so we actually approach them and we see them with their either with their corporate social responsibility agenda or the social impact agenda if they can work along with us to bring that change, to really use technology uh, to impact the social, uh, the last mile. And we spread a lot of awareness about what's the difference they can make. That's interesting. <laughs> Why does NASCOM Foundation focus on the SDGs? And when did you start that journey? So it's very important that uh, anybody who's working to bring a change is aligned to either a global agenda or a national agenda because when um, people from different sides come together and collaborate it's easier to make a difference so we feel that the world is working towards sdgs the country is working towards sdgs and if we really have that focus ourselves um, it would be more impactful, more effective for us to work out uh, along with that. And we have been working on SDGs for a while, but more so focus in the last three years. So since 2021, it has been a major focus on SDGs. I look forward to NASCOM Foundation talk about tech for good. Why do you believe technology is important? So if you really look at a country, uh, we have more than 1.4 billion population. Uh, in a country like India, if we need to bring any change, it has to be done at scale. And how can scale come? Scale can come when technology is a integrated part of that. So technology can actually help us to reach the people at the last mile in the rural areas at a low cost and have a quicker, faster way of bringing out a change. SDG 12 talks about responsible consumption. What would be your advice for all of us on responsible consumption? So, just like anything else, everything has a positive and a negative side. And technology also has both. It has its, uh, of course, it has a very positive side that it contributes to social impact. But also it can be a little negative and dangerous in many ways. So responsible consumption could also be about the amount of time that you use technology, how you use technology, how safe do you keep yourself. Um, even technology means that you're consuming energy in different ways. How can we regulate that? So it is about being aware that whatever technology you're using, 
how is it really impacting the climate? How is it impacting other things in the environment? So once we are aware about it, we, should, we would also be mindful about how we use technology. First question. What would you like the young people who saw me viewing this to remember? Or any one point you may be with us before the end of today's episode? So you are the future of the country. Uh, you are the ones who are actually going to take this country ahead and make sure that it's a very integrated, inclusive road. So one, be aware about that what are the advantages you have, what are the privileges you have. Uh, just make sure that with your privileges, you have somebody else and be mindful about how you use the available resources to make it a more sustainable country. Thank you. Welcome, it was a pleasure speaking to you. Thank you, Nidhi, and thank you to all my listeners for tuning in.